Hi, Dan Henson from Paris this time. Uh, we were at Farnborough uh, last year. I brought the Scorpion aircraft here to Paris again uh, this year. Actually, it's our first time here in Paris. We have some, made some improvements to the airplane since we had it last year in Farnborough. The rear cockpit has got a 15-inch display in it to be able to take full advantage of the new systems that we have in, uh, installed in the airplane. That's the uh, MX-15 HDI we had last year. Uh, now we can display on a full HD display as well. We also have the Talos iMaster uh, radar in a 15-inch turret format integrated into the airplane. We'll be demonstrating those uh, in a few weeks actually off the south coast of England during an exercise that we're running down there. Uh, otherwise the airplane has proven itself to be a durable, dependable airplane. Uh, went down to South America uh, a few months ago, uh, completely unsupported. Went down there just the two of us in the cockpit uh, and uh, did some flight demonstrations down there and then came all the way back uh, via Miami and up uh, the eastern United States. So all in all we've been running the airplane pretty steady uh, and hard. We just went over 400 hours on our trip here and uh, we're in process of uh, bringing another one out uh, sometime uh, between April and June of next year. So we're building another airplane uh, in the certification configuration. Uh, we learned a lot from flying this airplane for the last year and a half uh, and the year since Farnborough, of course. Uh, we're taking all those lessons learned and, and all the uh, good ideas from people that we talked about and rolling that into the production configuration of the airplane. Uh, expect to have that between April and June of next year. We'll start flying, then we'll have two airplanes. Beyond that, well, we're continuing to use this airplane for demonstrations and for development of mission systems, etc., uh, including uh, some weapons integration work. We'll be working on uh, developing pylons for the airplane and then uh, integrating the uh, mission system requisite for uh, controlling and delivering uh, weapons uh, and also uh, mounting them on pylons and beginning to do the aerodynamic integration of weapons as well. So that's kind of what we have set out for the next year. Uh, set in front of us, uh, continued integration of mission systems, uh, advancing in the weapons integration work, and uh, working on flying out our production configuration airplane.